Oh yeah, isn't that just a pretty screen? Not. What's up guys, John Wood here, author on wheels, also the author of A Fight to Survive. I hope you've already clicked like on this video, subscribed to the channel, and you are ready for a new chapter in the story of Author on Wheels. On this chapter, technology has a tendency to be a bit of a problem when you are trying to work on something and it's telling you, time to update, but wait, there's more. The update you need is not compatible with the current software you have, and you need to update or change everything completely. The other night, I was up until 12.30 in the morning, pulling my damn hair out, trying to install an update for the iOS on my Mac Mini. And come to find out, my device ceased updating its operating system in 2018. <sighs> After version 12.8.1. And I need 13.6.5. It's freaking annoying. Today, I'm going to start off by giving you guys the top 10 list of computers available on Google through tomsguide.com. And then I'm going to give you my top three ways of getting through technology failures in order to tell your story. Let's go. This is not my list. This list comes from a website called tomsguide.com. And I will leave the link to it down in the description. Number one. Apple iMac 24 inch. Number two, Alienware Aurora R15, the best gaming PC overall for all you gamers out there. Number three, the Apple Mac Studio M2. Number four, the Acer Predator Orion 3000. Number five, the Dell XPS 8960. Number six, the Apple Mac Mini with M2. I believe that's the one I have. Number seven, Microsoft Surface Studio 2. Number eight, the MSI MEG Trident X. And number nine, the Raspberry Pi Model B. And that's the Raspberry Pi 4 Model B. Now, let's get into my top three tips for working around technology failures. Number one, plain and simple. Back up your work and try to continue on another system. The beauty of my writing is I use Google Docs and it continues with all of my stuff through my Gmail account. Number two, when you do not have access to a computer, try to remember where you left off on your writing and write the story by hand. That's why God gave us paper and pens. And number three, always remember to update your systems every three to five years as directed. And with that being said, this chapter of Author on Wheels has come to a close. Thank you for joining me on this journey. If you'd like more chapters like this, please leave a like and a comment down below. If you'd like to follow my journey, I invite you to subscribe to the channel. I also invite you to join us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and the official Author on Wheels podcast. All of the links for this will be down in the description, along with a direct link to purchase copies of my book, A Fight to Survive. Also, if you'd like a purchase official author on wheels merchandise i invite you to click the merchandise link to spreadsheet down in the description underneath all of the social media information but before i end this video let me ask you a question i tell my story on wheels what about you let's turn the page and let the next chapter begin see you soon